Hello again, YouTubers! Automate SpongeBob 101 back here again on the other sub channel. Today we have something very amazing to unbox on video for you guys. As you can read from the title, it is none other than the all new Nintendo Switch Animal Crossing New Horizons Special Edition console. So, this is the console that I just picked up today. Um, and I also got the game, which I'm actually selling off in a moment. So, um, this is uh, the Korean edition. Um, of course, I personally don't like um, collecting any editions that are not um, in English, um, just because it's a, yeah, just a personal preference. So that's why I'm selling that off. But um, this video is not about the game itself, it's actually about the console. Now you notice, the game is sold separately in uh, the United States and Canada, I believe. Uh, it is sold separately, but in Europe, there might be a download code in your console uh, uh, that comes along with the console. So um, it depends on where you live and where you're purchasing it from. So without further ado, I'm gonna give you guys a look at the box and we'll see how awesome and how detailed this box actually is before we, of course we get into the console. Taking a look at the box, over here we have a little airport, um, some tents, trees, uh, the coconut tree, and of course it says special edition, Animal Crossing New Horizons game sold separately. We also have the uh, con well the Joy Cons displayed on the front, as well as the tablet and dock along with Tom Nook over there. So that is the front. On the top, we literally have only one thing: the Nintendo logo. So that is uh, well nothing special. All left to the side of the box, we have Nintendo Switch. Of course, shows you the front with the pastel uh, pastel green and pastel blue um, Joy Cons, and on the back we have that great motif. Uh, island pattern console with two-tone Joy-Con controllers, so it really is really cool. And of course, we have the message in the bottle, uh, a little ship over there. So yeah, a lot of great. The detail. right side of the uh, box, we just have the Nintendo Switch logo with a um, wood, well, background or backing. Of course, the box is not wood, but you know, you get what I mean. Uh, we have some uh, a whale, maybe a dolphin, um, some birds. So yeah, and on the back we have Dodo Airlines. Um, this is the date that um, Animal Crossing's uh, Animal Crossing New Horizons came out. Of course, March twentieth, twenty twenty. We have the little seaplane, airplane, etc. Whatever you want to call it. Um, it says Dodo Airlines and Nook Inc. Also, this little airport symbol and little Nintendo. contents list. Of course, we have the Nintendo Switch console, the tablet itself. We have the two Joy-Cons, two Joy-Con straps, a high-speed HDMI cable, Nintendo Switch dock, a Joy-Con grip, and the Nintendo Switch AC adapter, a 32 gigabytes of uh, system storage as well. So yeah, that is that. Um, of course, you get the serial number, which I'm not going to show you guys, of course, um, on the bottom as well. Alright, so now that we have taken a good look at the awesome box for this uh, Animal Crossing New Horizons uh, Switch, we're gonna um, open it. Right, so uh, there is a, a little flap here that you can pull out and this thing at the top uh, basically folds out. So, um, so it says basically plug it in, um, set it up, and of course if you need help you can always visit support ninten support.nintendo.com. So we're gonna put it down and there we go. So our beautiful Joy-Cons are on the top left and the um, console proper is on the right. Okay, so now we're gonna remove the, um, well, the console, uh, the main console first. I'm going to, um, where is that little, oh yes, okay. So I'm gonna cover the serial number, um, just so, you know. <laughs> I'm gonna remove the plastic and I'm just gonna show you guys the back while we're at it. So it's uh, in this little plastic, well, wrap here. I'm just gonna pull that out. And on the back, we have um, that motif, right? That you um, saw earlier on the box. Well, you can see it up front right now. So first we have like the tent, um, planting flowers, a little campfire there, uh, some trees on the side. And there's a lighthouse um, with some fruit, bananas. Um, there's also a snowman, a house. So that's a wintry theme over there. Uh, more camping in the woods. And then on top here, we have like a little cafe table uh, with a chair. Um, so yeah, really, really nice. There's a random balloon over there. Really nice, um, in my opinion. And um, 
I'm really glad to be able to, you know, um, pick this up and show it to you guys. So now, personally, I have not owned a actual Nintendo Switch yet. So far, I've only had this um, Zashian and Zamazenta Nintendo Switch Lite, which you might have watched the unboxing of, um, well, last November. I'm gonna switch on the, uh, the system first, and I'll show you guys the rest of the console. So okay, so going from, um, well, the sides first, here is the right side of the console. This is where the right Joy-Con comes in, again, the back, as well as the left side where the left Joy-Con comes in. Now we can take a look at the top over here. Um, basically, it's essentially the same style of switch, uh, power button, the volume buttons, um, the ventilation, well, vents, um, headphone jack, as well as that slot where you put in your uh, Switch game card. So, of course, you can only put in one game card at a time. This thing actually hides the SD card slot. I'm not going to open it right now because it's a little bit tough to open, um, but that is that. And on the bottom, of course, we have the serial number as well as the, um, the USB-C charging port. So that is there and again of course you can open the sd card charger uh, sd card slot from from the bottom here um let's see if the switch is all powered up in order to use the switch of course we need to take out the joy cons so i'm going to take out the first one the green one over here um really really nice uh, as i mentioned earlier um the joy cons are actually the reason why i like this um console so much because they really look absolutely amazing um, I'll give you guys a look at the back um, I noticed that this particular system is made in China I understand that uh, many European sets as well as the North American sets were made in Vietnam so I'm not so sure um, why the difference uh, but of course uh, in the current circumstances production in China has really dropped in a sense so this is the blue one um, the right side, of course, we have the home button, um, the, well, the joystick, is that what it's called? I, I can't even remember. Um, of course, the buttons as well as the plus button. So we have these two. Again, this is the screenshot button. So um, the, one of the reasons why I purchased this set as well is because I wanted to, you know, use a capture card to, uh, well, record videos for the upcoming SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated game, which I have already pre-ordered for Nintendo Switch. So um, anyway, back to the unboxing, right? So we have the back, which is a white color. Um, really looks great, uh, to be honest. I really like it. Okay, so now I'm going to, um, well, put it on, put the Joy-Cons onto the Switch. Okay, so now let's take a look at the Switch console um, with the Joy-Cons on it, right? So we have the blue Joy-Con on the side here. Um, really nice again. So we just slot it in right there. And then you have that blue little shockwave there. Then on the right, we uh, on the left, excuse me, we have the green one. So yeah, there you go. And yeah, so that is basically the Switch um, console from the back. Um, just give you guys a look. We have the white as well as the black contrasting. So yeah, that's um, really the, the main cool part is the front, the green and the blue. So yeah, that's the main, well, selling point, I guess. Okay, so we've now taken a look at the actual Switch console, but that is not all there is in the box, right? So we're gonna remove this little tray over here and we're gonna put it aside. Underneath we have some more goodies, of course, which you paid for, so you should probably use. Uh, first up, we have the, um, Nintendo Switch and Nintendo Switch Lite important information, right? So um, health and safety information. Um, so yeah, you guys probably know or at least are aware of how to use a Switch by now. So here we have the first of two uh, Joy-Con grips. Uh, sorry, not the grip, but the um, wrist strap, right? So basically you attach it to the Joy-Con um, and um, here we have the green one. It looks really, really nice. Um, and of course this lights up, I believe. So this is the minus side um, or plus side. You can use it in either way you prefer. Um, we also have the blue one. So the blue one is on the bottom. And um, yeah, same thing, right? So minus side, the plus side, and um, you just slot these in. So I'm gonna actually 
remove, I dislodged the um, dry cons from the switch for now. And I'm going to attach them to this. So I believe you just have to slot it in. And there we go. So we have that. And of course, controller number one. Um, so yeah, again, of course the switch, uh, the switch, not the switch light, is a multiplayer system. So of course you can play with, you know, two players. Um, this one is the plus, uh, plus site. So I think it's gonna say, oh, it just says the same thing. Um, but I'm pretty sure you can set it up for multiplayer play. So looks really good. Um, and of course you can lock it if you want to. Uh, you can just lock it over there and then you're good to go. You can play uh, two players, of course, can play at the same time. Okay, so on the left side here, we have the HDMI cable. This one goes into your TV or monitor as well as the AC adapter, which uh, I believe this is USB-C. This is a Nintendo over there. Obviously, you'll need that to charge your Switch. Personally, um, I haven't used the charger in the Switch Lite because that one was the uh, Japan charger and um, I'm really just using the MacBook Pro uh, USB-C to USB-C charging cable. Um, that's good enough for me. Okay, so in the middle here, we have this little pocket with the Nintendo Switch um, well, Joy-Con remote controller. Okay, so I managed to quickly remove the Joy-Cons from the wrist straps and now um, to use the remote, all you have to do, well, is literally just plug the, um, well, the Joy-Cons in there. So that's really nice. And this is of course the other way you can play, especially if you're using the Switch in dock mode and you're playing and, uh, you know, viewing it from a monitor or a TV um, on the back. Well, it just says Nintendo, so that's really nice. Um, but on the front, of course, that's where the magic is. The pastel green and the pastel blue, really nice. Okay, so that is the remote. We have one more thing. Um, this is not an Apple video, but you know, one more thing, right? Um, on the right side of the box, we have this little thing covered in bubble wrap and um, foam wrap, is this what it's called? It is none other than the Switch dock. Right, so um, this features Tom Nook and his associates on the deserted island with the leaf logo. Um, of course, the water on the side here, you have the TV symbol to tell you if uh, it's connected to a monitor. On the side, it, it looks basically like any other Switch dock except that it's white instead of the usual gray slash black. Um, the USB-C slots over here. Um, on the top, there is a Nintendo Switch logo in white. So it's a little bit hard to see, but I'm pretty sure you guys can see it if I you know, put it this way. Um, so that is that. On the right side, of it, um, again, there's another look at it. On the back, we have the HDMI ports, which are behind this little flap, which I'm gonna open in a moment, but let's admire the Nintendo logo. Just kidding. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna open that. Um, AC adapter, we have the USB port and a HDMI out port. So, so yeah, there we go. That is the Nintendo Switch Animal Crossing New Horizons special edition in dock in dock mode uh, with the dock there and of course uh, you can use it this way to play on the TV um, I'm pretty sure you uh, I mean you could charge it this way but then you know you got to remove the joy cons if you want to play on TV regardless that is that for our unboxing video I hope you guys enjoyed the video I really enjoyed um, showing uh, showing off this console to you guys um, did you manage to pick up one of these for yourselves? Comment in the box below. Uh, make sure to subscribe if you like um, these Nintendo Switch unboxing videos. Um, make sure to like, favorite, comment, etc. Keep right here on Automate Spongebob 101's Other Stuff channel. And we have plenty more Other Stuff videos coming up for you guys in the near future. So yeah, till the next video. See you guys later. Bye.